Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Azzy here and you're watching Azzy Kelly Hustlers. So in this series, you're going to learn a lot about sales marketing and everything to do with small businesses. I'm going to interview my cousin, which is Aisha. She has a Abaya business all the way from Dubai and her designs are so, so amazing. I love it. That's why I just called her and I was like, yo, want to come in my series? <laughs> and yeah, she came true. Anyway, so... Pro tip, I have a pro tip today, uh, two actually. One is the book that I'm currently reading. I really love, love this book and I think it will benefit you guys. So try and check it out. It's this book right here. This book is sell like crazy. Um, how to get as many clients, customers and sales as you can possibly handle by Sabri Subi. Number one international bestseller so why not right and i think it really benefit uh to my what i'm doing right now the marketing uh info and basically it's just like showing you how to sell yourself believe in yourself believe in the product believe in your services and it's gonna show it's gonna show to everybody and from there that kind of energy just translate to your business and obviously people is gonna be interested in buying your products like what i'm doing right now and i'm so so excited for this series and i know how it could grow later on and i'm just taking it step by step just doing it is one step further than anybody else how to work hard and also smart in a way of marketing and also it doesn't matter on what playing field you are you still need to sell your products and services am i right he basically just give you ideas upon ideas on how you can expand your business and scale it to the level that you didn't think it's possible for your business guys so go and get the book it's free and you're just gonna have to pay for that delivery charges my second tip is to check out the canva pro that i just got for one bucks yes i bought it in shopee and it's just one bucks and i hope you guys are happy and excited for that because it, the link is in the description box below i'm gonna list everything everything even the context of my interview and everything okay so i hope this will really add value to your businesses your side hustle babes okay on the road to 1k guys so don't forget to subscribe to my channel without further ado let's get into this interview today i have my cousin so i'm with aisha uh introduce yourself Hello, hi guys. First of all, thank you Azima for having me here. So my name is Noraisha Binti Sar Ali. I'm the founder of Shosho Designs, whereby we actually sell abaya. We bring abaya from import abaya from Dubai. Uh, we are into fashion, modesty, uh, designs. Yeah. Okay. By the way, my partner is Miss Balkis. She's supposed to be here today, but she can't make it. Uh -uh. She couldn't make it. <laughs> yourself in three words in three words yes true i'm um, very bubbly funny at the same time mm -hmm. independent yes and i'm brave to an extent who would you rather be if you're not you who's your idol basically i would say nova i'm really really inspired by her mm -hmm. i really like the way she brings herself up spiritually uh, yeah. business wise mm -hmm. i think she's a great leader mm -hmm. the way she handles her team what's your spirit animal um, people say I'm very garang. <laughs> I was like, yeah. I thought nothing going to be I hope not lah. <laughs> I'm not actually, but then I'm very like, you know, harsh. Uh, so I would say maybe straightforward lah. Tiger, uh, tiger, tiger or lion. Okay. What's your first job? During school time, I used to do like part-time job. Does okay. It, does, does that yes, count? Yes, yeah. yes. I used to work in a department store. Oh, as okay. A sales girl. Ah, the company. Dekat masa tu, have you heard of Hong Kong? No! <laughs> <laughs> then you were young, you're actually very young. Uh -huh. Brand called Durban. So oh, okay, like I Durban. Durban. Yeah, yeah. Take me back to the idea moment. How it all started. I love this that business because I personally, I love Abaya. Mm -hmm. it, she always yeah, talk about I it. I always wear Abaya myself. Uh, yes! So since 2012 actually, I started this business. But then it was like on off, on off. Mm -hmm. 2016, I started online, seriously online, and then IG, yeah, IG and Facebook, and ah, okay. 
I was doing it part time actually, mm -hmm. but I, it was running. I was still working in a job at that that time. I was in Dubai, mm -hmm. so being in Dubai was like the heaven. Yeah, because For I Abaya. yes, I tend to learn everything like the in and out of Abaya business and everything. Last year, somewhere in May, okay. I decided I took a decision to actually quit my job oh. and get into my business. What were you doing? I was a business development manager in a recruitment company. Wow, yeah. okay, okay. So the area where uh, it's a heaven for Abaya, right? So yes. you know where to acquire, where to get your stuff True. and everything. And most of the time when I go for business, I tend to look for the Abaya myself, for myself. Ah, <laughs> I'm okay, a mother. Okay. So the business like really sparked from there, lah, basically. Yeah. Uh, what is your brand uh, stands for? What's your motto? Our motto is about be elegant, stay classy. Mm -hmm. Because you see, when people talk about mm -hmm. jupa, wearing abaya, yeah. people always think it's boring or it's like you have to cover the whole. I mean, of course, we are covering at the same time, you are looking very fashionable. Okay, okay? Uh, tell me the story about you know how in the movie Sex in the City, where there's these ladies. Uh, yeah, you never watched? I watched but I don't remember scenes, I don't remember movies Ah, okay, okay, so basically there's this one scene where the ladies were uh, meet in a tent But they were like and uh, all of them were wearing like orders, mm -hmm. like abaya uh, But mm -hmm. underneath, they were wearing like these oh, sexy clothes yes. So tell me about it, is it really, yes. really because you see, the culture the Arabs, there? The Arabs, especially in Dubai, mm -hmm. they are wearing abaya, mm -hmm. okay, but very modest mm -hmm. outside. But then if you go to the toilet or something, the way they are, they are wearing inside, uh -huh. uh, color European way. Oh. And if they go for wedding, uh -huh. keluar abaya we. Uh -huh. So, <laughs> because it's all ladies, no uh, camera allowed and everything. Oh. The way they wear, the way they dress up. Let's have Kala a Oscar, you know, when you go for Oscars, can uh, Kala all those people. Uh, let's have one day. Yeah. <laughs> We've been planning for that. Yeah. <laughs> for failure, right? You can't have success without failure. So, what are your thoughts on that? Especially um, on your business side. Well, well, in business, I am still new and I'm still learning actually. Mm -hmm. And for me, failure is learning both. Mm -hmm. Because uh, people always think that business is always like flowery mm -mm -mm. failure when it comes to <laughs> failure you don't think that you fail mm. when i started my business mm -hmm. i kind of like rushed into it uh, mm. without doing a proper research without doing a proper i just because it was my passion you know yeah i was so excited we, about it everyone is like that yeah yes. so so uh, learn from these guys <laughs> <laughs> okay so i just wanted to start i just i felt like i know i have to do it it's been long i like, so Betul, your your dream was like already planned from two years already. Yes. But you still think that it was a rush thing. Yeah, I still think because uh, uh, I didn't do a proper um, business, business plan. Said, business plan. Uh -huh. uh, my business somehow ran without a proper system. I would say. Uh -huh. uh, so that's where I failed. Did that. you set goals? Yeah, along the did. way. Yeah, I did. That uh, we did set a goal. Uh -huh. So, uh, what were you question again? <laughs> Uh, okay, tell us what's your advice to everyone or the girls out there, especially how to start a business and especially like yours, like you are in the fashion industry, right? Advice, eh? Mm -hmm. Again, I'm not the best person to advise, but then I would share my thoughts. Yes. Uh, don't do the same mistake as I did, lah. You know, basically, before you start the business, I know we are all excited. Nasa nak start business, we are so excited. We just want to just boom start the business, uh, but. What we need to do is have a proper system, okay. do the proper research, and most important thing is you have to have that determination because people always think, as I said earlier, business is like macam all flowery mm -hmm. and like macam oh business is like macam luxury Not and everything. All. No, it's all hard work. Mindset kena betul. Yes. You have to have the proper mindset with that. Yeah. This is not going to be easy. Mm -hmm. This is not like going into a job day in day out. No. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you can, uh, you know, perah otak. It's more of uh, mental pressure, I would say. And no. you work like the whole day. Yes. Day yes. and night. Yes. Yeah. Uh, you tak ada nak masa kata, oh, I'll clock in nine mm -hmm. to five. No, 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 no. no, no, no. no. <laughs> so yeah, uh, do proper research. Yeah. Study, really study on marketing skill, marketing, marketing, yes. marketing, guys. And ask around. So that's jangan yeah. malu bertanya. Exactly. What's the peri bahasa? Malu bertanya. Tinggal jalan, something like that. Uh, so you'll be like uh, lost if you don't ask, you know. So people who are already in the business. Yes. 
but do not take everything into consideration do it in your line of business True. and also your uh, research True. in the market because obviously it may not apply in your business and usually they will also discourage you True. because exactly <laughs> not everyone's uh, advice is valid yes okay you have to know what you want to accept and what you don't have but to. you have to filter lah basically pakai penapis tu eh the best question what is the best advice you ever gotten from anyone like your parents or anyone i'm a person where i'm very unorganized mm -hmm. okay my mind is i'm always full of ideas you know like oh i want to do this i want to do that blah blah blah, blah you know <laughs> <laughs> berangan lebih uh. like. but then the best advice that i've gotten is um to be focused mm. you know because my my mind has to be focused on what i am good in okay so and i have to only focus on that mm -hmm. don't do two three things you can multitask yes. but once one thing is done mm -hmm. okay then you go for another thing mm -hmm. because kalau you do what this is some yeah. uh, i'm saying this masa kita mula mula start Okay, especially when you just you are just starting a business, mm -mm. jangan get into like so many things. Mm. Yeah, so that's my best advice I've ever gotten actually because when it comes to knowing myself mm -hmm. and when someone is actually because the person has seen how I work and everything, so when I got that, I was like, yeah. Who actually, who gave you this advice? Uh, one I'm of, curious. <laughs> <laughs> one of my ex boss actually. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Um, one of my ex boss. Uh -huh. Yeah. See, advice come from anywhere. Exactly. I didn't expect. I mean, honestly, I didn't expect this to be a word. Yeah, much. Um, I will really remember. Uh, yeah, like really like push you through to go to get. Because it. I used to be like, macam when I was telling you. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, actually, you know what? what? This was the reason uh -uh. when I decided to quit my job uh -uh. and fully get into business. Uh, because okay. he was telling me that. I was like satu kaki sini satu kaki kaki sana when uh, I was doing part time okay, I was running okay. my business part time uh, uh, uh. I was like macam tu you uh, know so uh, he said focus in one thing mm -mm. Yeah. okay girls now why you should be getting our abayas our abayas are not just some plain boring abayas our abayas are very trendy classy we have vibrant colors varieties of designs different different designs designs that you can actually wear for weddings for functions for events and these abayas are actually imported from all the way from dubai guys and for something imported our price is very very reasonable in the market we use only high quality top-notch material for all our abayas please follow our facebook and instagram at social designs abaya and dubai exclusive abaya for our new upcoming designs thank you so much so i guess that's it but uh anything you want to add like okay regarding this hustlers punya rancangan ke oh you know <laughs> what oh, okay. i'm actually very very proud of azima oh no no uh, no, so no, no, not this <laughs> no no seriously because you see knowing azima okay like we've, we've been like quite close recently okay? mm -hmm. so much like, knowing her she's always sharing about uh what she wants to do we, we share ideas but she's actually a very shy person okay the bandar pai she's actually very shy yeah. but guys did you see like her first video nampak tak dia malu not at all <laughs> no, seriously you are doing so good oh, thank you thank you <laughs> please share this video and yes okay that's why i want to <laughs> yeah share this video like this video i hope you guys subscribe to this channel so yeah, yeah. Ask your friend also to subscribe, okay? Ask as many as you guys. Yeah, okay, I would do the same. Please, eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, she already is doing a subscriber. Yes. Yes. Okay. Bye. 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 Okay. Oh, <laughs> Every day I'm hustling. Every day I'm hustling. Every day I'm hustling. 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 Oh, Bye. Bye. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Thank you for coming. Bye. Bye. Thank you for watching, guys. Hi, everyone. So, I'm going to be a check out Jindy. <laughs> Hazima, thank you so much for having me here. <laughs> what lagi? Kau <laughs> tiba bila you nak cakap dengan kamera, you slow oh, down tau. Nice. Dengan I dah kuat. <laughs> okay, let's okay, get it. Okay. Introduce yourself. My name is Nur Aisha bin Jangan. <laughs> <laughs>